keep it secrets to different bills. Hey, don't go dim it, you need it, I got it listed, yeah. You wanna make it, I'll show you just how to make it, yeah. I got all the rarest bills, and I ain't done, yeah. I'm from the finish to making bills like a prospect. Flow space and slashes to catching us with a lot threat. You keep the medals, cause the real ones coming up next. Only scratch the surface, still they try to drag my name in dirt, they try to bring me down. See me when you ain't like me. Yo, what's good, my nephews and nieces? This is your favorite uncle, Uncle Demi, and today I have another special banger for you, right? Today we're gonna be talking about builds that you just knocked. You just need to go ahead and just let go, right? Going in 24. But before we get into the video, though, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. It's liking up the video, push the video to the recommended, and of course, subscribe and put you know the game for my daily uploads. But without further ado, let's hop straight into this video. So, we already know right now, if I'm looking at point guard, what we're gonna talk about. I really want to break down the six ones and six nines and also a center build that um, just is not going to happen in 2K24. Um, obviously, I can't get in too much depth about it um, because I cannot speak about the builder, but I can let you know just off the stuff that has been released of why this is just not the wave. Okay, so we all know point guards, people go six one, and then you know, your weight wingspan is all about preference, okay? But I want you to take a look at this build. 22 22 22 and 23 all right we all know that the bad stacks um i mean the badge tiers and all types stuff are different now there's no more points totals i love the fact that it's all about how you play but at the end of the day you know there is a reality that needs to be set in okay um and and the first thing is is that you're just the, the thing is this you're not going to be able to make everything like this again like it's just not gonna happen the six ones and six nines they had so many bash points to work with i mean look at this man look at this look on defense all right silver clamps and gold glove hall of fame minutes i know people were saying like this wasn't a demigod like yo six ones aren't demigods um and there's really more of the like the the league players were saying that but this is a demigod build right this is a demigod build it has gold glove silver clamps gets trey young or steve Kerr. i mean um steph curry it has um, uh, 89 three ball where it gives you gold agent threes you get limitless on silver but see this right here gets contact dunks and you see right here it has an 85 and the contact dunks that you're able to get are the small and um, pro contact dunks so what that means is is that this build is like Ja Morant with like a Steph Curry jump shot with uh, Marcus Smart defense like <laughs> that's basically what it is it's a straight up demigod build like it can do it all and you can also change um the build to where you can get you drop your wingspan down and then you can get a 92 three ball and then and get an 80 driving dunk right you get 93 ball a 92 three ball and then i'll give you gold limitless and then you'll be able to get you know just quick drops well like i said stuff like this where every single pie chart is is basically fooled out like this is just something that's not gonna make a pie chart um um attributes that's fooled out like this that's just not gonna happen um and that's a good thing okay that's a good thing and we can start for a couple things here speed with ball is now um attached to other things like i've been saying before you know i've been listen if you watch my other videos you'll know exactly what i'm talking about but now that i've actually played it and i got a real big embargo on me um i can't tell you but speed is attached to stuff okay acceleration is attached to stuff i know people already peeped that stamina is attached to stuff strength look at this there's no strength here strength is attached to stuff okay so what that means is is that you're gonna have to have a higher speed you're gonna have to have higher strength to be able to get certain badges that you want and you're just not able to do that okay now we also know all the tiers okay animation tiers are pushed way much higher okay so now you can understand that you're not gonna be able to get agent threes on gold it's not happening okay you're not able to get silver contact dunks all right with an 86 it's not happening okay um you're not able to get fearless finisher um or giant slayer um hall of fame and, and gold respectfully with an 84 it's just not gonna happen all right um what else speed with ball you're not even able to get steph curry um or Trey Young with a 77 speed with ball, and you gotta have a way much higher speed and acceleration. Like, just come on, just follow me what I'm saying here. You can see how, how that already starts pushing things down. And you can see for the longest when I've been saying like, yo, like if you can go back to 2K20, look at those pie charts, you'll get an understanding of what you can make. Like literally what you can do is load up 2K20, not 2K21, 2K20, 
and then start looking at those pie charts and then see what we actually played with back then and did really well with because I think a lot of people are going to look at this like the defense is crazy the playmaking all that and think like man my bill is going to be no because understand everybody is going to have bills like this so it's still going to be on the same level playing ground because now it's going to cost you know everybody's going to have to figure out what they're going what they're how they're going to be dominant and what's the best way to be dominant okay so that's one way all right then we're going to go here but right? we already know six nines and what, what's going on here all right but um you can't even make my point guards but now let's go to six nines and i can literally be on here right now with you and just make a six nine like it ain't nothing like we all know how overpowered these builds was and then again like i said nothing changes here go up to an 81 max out this get that 75 speed with ball uh, most people would just go 75 here go ahead and get your steal right here on silver go ahead and get that 87 right here go ahead and get your block up to an 87 go ahead and max out your speed go 75 speed with ball go 75 strength get your stamina here and i'm making a quick one here like this is not putting any time in then some people like to push up their defense and rebound up to like you know get to 70 and a 60 or something like this right um and then you can see you still got so much more to play with so then like what i did was i had a high standing dunk because i wanted to make sure and i went up to silver so i had a high standing dunk because i wanted to make sure i could be able to just go under the basket do a couple head fakes and get a good standing dunk all right and then you can still have more here like look at this look at this 93 so now I have a 93 anchor, okay? I have clamps, I have glove, all right? And then the same, listen, the same exact thing here, okay? You're not gonna be able to get gold anchor with a 93. And also, like I said, block is gonna be associated to other things also. Steel is gonna be associated to other things. Perimeter defense, and again, like I said, you're not able to get silver, uh, what is this? Um, silver um, clamps at this 87 no more, no same for the steals. Um, ball handle, 87 ball handle, what it gave you, you know, the first of all, clamp breaker's not here, but like for unpluckable and all this stuff, you're not able to get them at these tiers. Everything's been pushed up. Um, this is a, this is gone. Like it's gone. So all I'm trying to tell you is that you want to literally focus and lock in on trying to figure out what you're really going to be great at and go straight hard at it. Like don't even hesitate. If you feel like you'll be a great slasher, go all out to be a slasher. Because if you want to get all the really good slashing badges, you got to be a slasher. If you want to be a shooter, go all out and be a shooter. Off balls should like 2K19 off ball. Listen, pay attention to me. All right. Like, you know, I, I just want y'all to literally listen to what I'm about to say right now. Okay. Off balls are going to be another very, 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 very lethal playset to use. So if you're somebody that says, hey, you know, you can literally run with no ball handling. Have someone bring the ball up the court, have your man set a screen, be a peer sharp, and just do off-ball screens and go crazy, all right? There's badges. We already seen the badges, you know, that they have now that you're able to go absolutely crazy with. Now, I do know we got Claymore. We got Open. Um, I can't, I don't have everything up right now in front of me, but you know what badges we're talking about, the new badges that we have. Um, let me see if I can pull it up real quick because I want y'all to understand that there is some crazy badges here that you definitely gonna want to look at. Open looks, okay, as a way to encourage sudden opportunities. Open looks. You got spot finder. By tapping R2, it gives you like a boost. It's almost like a speed boost off ball, right? And that's gonna allow you when someone set a screen, you can tap R2 and get crazy separation on an off ball. Okay. So I understand I want people to think about the new badges and um how it's gonna change the way we can play. ISO, pick and roll, and off ball are going to be really, really good. And I'm telling you right now, if you remember, everybody remember Ruffles, 2K19, man. A lot of sharps was just pure sharps getting off ball set. Um, we had centers. We had people doing five centers, like, or five stretches. And this has someone bring up the court. One person was setting screens, running off ball with the stretch. And it was very hard to stop. So, again, there's going to be other ways. So, if you want to be a sharp, be a sharp. You want to be a pair of playmaker, be a pair of playmaker. Because a pair of playmaker is going to have badges that no one else can get. Because at the end of the day, you're just not going to have enough badge attributes to go around. If you want to be a pure lock, be a pure lockdown because you're going to have badges that no one else can have because you have to be pure to get them. Okay, so understand what I'm saying. Throw these bills out the way. They're not happening anymore. These like crazy categories not happen, man. So like, again, man, shout out to Wolf and shout out to Zach. They're not happening anymore, man. So make sure you come into 2K24 
with the mindset of, yo, what am I going to specialize in and just go with that and own it? Don't look at this and be missing this. Everybody's going to be in the same boat with you. Everybody's going to have the same bills. No one's going to be running out on the court with you making, you know, a pure green. And then someone out is going to run out of the court with something like this. It's not happening anymore. Okay. So just keep that in mind. And then now I want to go to something else. We'll change the positions because I really want people to know this is huge. All right. I got to go small forward with this. All right. Um, six tens. Okay. Six tens. And you see how you max your wingspan all the way out. And your ball handle is still an 81. So you're able to get elite dribbles and all that type of stuff. This build is dead. Okay. So you're not able to do that no more. So now you have to understand that if you're going to go big, you need to go all out. You know what I mean? And be specialized in being a glass cleaner, right? Being a glass cleaner or being um, a rim protector. We're blocking interior, interior defense. But the, the, to be able to have interior defense 99 or high 90s, a block as a 99, an offensive rebound or defensive rebound 99, it's just not going to happen anymore. So again, you're going to either want to be a pure glass with a low interior defense, lower block, or you want to be like, yo, lower offense, defensive rebound, have a higher block in interior defense, and just be consider yourself as a rim protector, okay? So either a rim protector, a glass cleaner, or you can be something, like I said, a pure um, athletic finisher. Athletic finishers are going to be really, really good. I spoke on this for so many times, and you know, so how like, you know, post scoring is going to be really good, and how slashing is going to be really good, and now, you know, hey, community days everybody's coming out and now you're starting to see what i'm talking about okay so understand these 610s that could dribble and do all that stuff more people you were having 610 builds they had 610 builds they packed they maxed out post control so they can get quick first step hall of fame and they were able to cook up because all you need was an 80 you had like really good pros um sigs there and then you could go crazy because you can get big man contact dunks at an 80 right pro big man contact dunks and then still go ahead and go here where you at at a 96 and be able to get limitless takeoff on hall of fame y'all know that listen y'all know the cheese man y'all know the cheese like it was very very op build that you could make you could still go out here and get that 81 three ball like y'all know the build that i'm about to make they're very very op i don't need to keep on going through it but people were able to go crazy with these builds it's no longer happening so again like i said you know Coming next week, I'm going to be dropping some very good extensive stuff. Um, hopefully, um, you know, y'all will be able to pick up what I'm saying when I have, and when the embargo's up. But listen, man, Unk got the juice. I got everything that you need, right? Make sure y'all put on notifications. Make sure y'all like up the video. Make sure y'all subscribing because I got the juice for you, right? But listen, if you love these type of videos, please make sure you click this video that just came up that I dropped a couple days ago. And other than that, this your favorite old head, Uncle Demi. I'll be back really, really soon with another banger, man. And you know, when I say back to another banger, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm talking about tomorrow, man. I'm out.